here we are, back at the garrison, and all of a sudden a few quests have opened up. But before we do anything, I want to check something out. I could create a forge, they said. I'm definitely going to need that. So, let's get that in progress. So that's going to require some construction time, so like an hour. In the meantime, let's see if we can put a few completed missions. Boosh! What do I get? Br contract. Room of Swiftstone. Okay, so that's that. And the other one. Okay, we'll just leave that for now. Although she does have a quest. So let's get to it. Our curse grants us Ashran strength. appearance. Our base on Ashran is almost a complete commander. It would be a huge show of support if you could make a trip out there and put your stamp of approval on their staging area. I can arrange a flight if you are interested. Speak with Private Tristan at Storm Shield in Ashram. Watch your back. Speak with Dunga when you are ready to fly to Ashram. I think I might just do that later. Oh, everybody had that job for me. Let's first gather the resources. And there's another egg there. Garrison resources. Oosh. Let's first sell some crap and sell these. I don't need these anymore. So that's that. I might as well try to send one of those missions after all. Let's try her on this job. Ah! Start mission. I'm gonna give her that shot anyway. There we go. So everyone just had the job for sending me to Ashran. So I guess we'll do that. We'll take a flight point there. Maybe we can enjoy the scenery there. Go with modern friend. So Ashran should be located, yep, there. And then we've got the south area, which is Storm Shield. Uh, I guess it's not too bad to get a little bit of a glimpse of what that place looks like. Now, let's just explain that things are a little bit different here than what we're familiar with. For example, as you can see, there's a lot of mushrooms. That's basically the sort of, you know, coral reef that they've got, but then it's a mushroom grove. And that's basically going to be found on all the coasts. As far as I understand. This is the Tanan jungle. I don't know when we're going to go there though. <laughs> Let's just make a quick overlook. So that's where we are right now. That's not going to be where we're going next. We're going to be going there next. Or here. I'm guessing we're going from Shadow Moon Valley to Gorgon. Probably for a flight. Some, then Talador. Then the Spires, then Nagrand, and I'm guessing Tanan Jungle is some sort of end zone. Probably a lot of dailies, if there are any, if there are any. There's a lot of dig sites around though, but I haven't been to any of them. But in the meantime, let's take a look at the scenery. Look at that. Yeah, it's the bad guys. It's the bad guy ships, but look at it. It's awesome. This whole area is incredibly impressive. Let's just hope Ashran isn't too populated. Now, yesterday I had a lot of latency issues because of, well, let's say overpopulation from all the players in. Now that's a little less because I'm playing at a timestamp that not everyone is playing right now. So, this is something that people were not too excited about, which was that Storm, sh that Ashran was becoming like the area where all 
people are, but uh, not old people. <laughs> what are your orders? Just a second, pal. Can't you see I'm busy here? Commander, I didn't think you were actually going to show. I mean, welcome, Commander. It's not ready yet. But then Hal said you might be showing up. It's such an honor to meet you in person. The lieutenant is at the end. I'll escort you. Have a good one. Wait, what did I just get? The end is this way, Commander. Now, Ashran is now where, let's say, the sort of small hub for the Alliance and Horde is located. They're separated, of course. For example, Horde is here. Uh, Horde is in the north. Lions is in the south. Now, some people aren't exactly. Not everyone was that excited about the idea that everyone had to come here as a hub zone. They were hoping that for the alliance it was going to be Carabor and that for the uh, horde it was going to be Frostfire, your uh, citadel. S but they changed it all of a sudden to this. So. Not everyone was excited. It's a bit of a disappointment myself, but I'm not making too much of a fuss out of it. I should have gotten rid of these. Now this is basically, you know, like a local merchant hub, portals to the other main to the other capital cities. You know, it's the usual thing, what do you expect? They've kept them quite separate, well, though why they put them into a PvP zone is a bit weird, to be honest. They're kind of like promoting to get back into this sort of more, you know, interactive world PvP area that Ashran is, but I've never been a big PvPer, so I won't be doing that. Though we have these places, which is a great place to be at, to be honest, but... So let's see what this Lieutenant Howell has well to say. Well met. Uh, Commander Orphesus, I'm so glad you can make it. It's a true honor, sir. I can't use I hope you will find... Use what? Inspiring... Uh, I hope you will find our facilities to be up to your high standards. This inn is run by Jace... Jacea Rochier. Rochier. In my opinion, this is the best place to harf in Draenor. We have new recruits coming in through the... The portal daily. In fact, our latest recruit, newbie McGreen, <laughs> seriously, just came through the portal today. If you are looking uh, to trade for weapons or armor, Finnegator Nurim will be happy to help. Light it's bless not you. Ready. Hi. Let's see who else is around here. Oh, up there in that building, I'm guessing. Well, this is the alchemy trainer. I'm gonna look and see if I can find the blacksmith. I'm guessing this is like the main town. Yeah, this is the town hall, as expected. Vindicator Nuremberg. You bring Council news? Of the oh, God. So this is what he... The dusty rock eye permanent time bubble? Relic of Carabor. Cleric Maloof. Exarch Elixir. Interesting, this thing, but... I need to be captain of the guard, okay. How did these guys get here? Okay, enough chit chatting. Let's get back to let's just scouting out this place. In the meantime I can ask this guy for where the blacksmith is. That's on my it's on my way, so <laughs> Ah, there you are. Blacksmith plans. Watch your back. Oh God, no. Ah, uh, fine. We'll just learn all the stuff that I didn't learn yet. This is gonna be pricey, but hey, I can spare it. 
This could take a while. And it's a bit pricey, but hey. Come on. That's pretty much uh, everything I can learn. <laughs> that didn't take as long as I expected it to be. Now, who is like Oh yeah, Newbie McGreens. He should be around... There he is, Newbie, Newbie McGreen. Greetings. Whoa, you're here too? Phew! I was starting to think I made a bad call. I'm ready to this war for the Alliance, sir. See you later. Good to see you, Newbie. You'll be a great asset. He'll probably get killed the first chance he gets on the front lines, but who cares? He's newbie McGreen. That's what he's meant to do. And what? Oh, that's a guy with a core with a green core hound. Could you please get rid of that thing? I don't like green smoke in my place. What can I do for you? Inspiring, inspiring. Thank you again for the taking the time to visit the commander. You have no idea how much it means to us. I can't use that. Before you go, there is someone you might want to talk with. He's opinionated, a, a bit gruff, and very overbearing, but he's the best damn warrior I've met in ages. He belongs on the front lines with you, commander, and trust me, he knows it. Delvar Iron. I don't know who it is. But a name, it's definitely a dwarf. <laughs> okay, he's in the barracks. Yes. He's a... Look, I don't have time for any... Oh, it's you! Suffer well. Well, it's about time you showed up. I'm done slumming around with these new recruits. Me blade is sharp, me armor is spit shined, and I'm combed my beard this morning. I've been ready for battle since my grandpa Gygax first put an axe in me, wi in me wee little hand. So what do you say, Commander? Tomorrow is Just point me in the direction of the Iron Horde and I'll take care of the rest. So that's it. So let's take a bit of a look around. So... This looks like more of a bit of the commerce area. A lot of those trainers. All that, you know. I'm guessing this is some sort of... Well, it's a fortress, but... What exactly is done here? Ah, it's the bank! Hi. Just what I was looking for. There we go, with that out of the way. Off with you. Set it all up right, there we go. I can actually throw that Great in too. To meet ya. So that's Watch the guild back. manker. Got the explorers league. Got my attention. And another explorers league. So the dwarves are taking care of our finances here. I'm pretty safe with that. If it was a gnomes, I would I would have filed a complaint, but the dwarves were rather competent, so I can live with this. So this is a little bit of a memorial area. We got this place, whatever this is. It's got a cute little bird here, apparently. Look at it, it's so cute! Oh, it's so cute! Then we got this place. Oh, this is the auction house, so they finally put an auction house in here, so there's no need to go back to capital you? cities. I'll check up on something when later here. I'm, gonna, I'm still looking for a certain glyph I'm trying to get my hands on. Fortunately, the the people are refusing to get my hands on it. Okay. So these are the dudes of Awakened and what these guys do. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. That wasn't huh, the plan. So this is another portal area. This is like the night elf section of everything. So they basically have things to everything around here. So they've got an area for the Arakoa, which we have not yet met. They are in this area. We've got a nice little fishing hut over here, apparently. If Nat Pagel's here, I'm gonna... Hey there. Well, it's not Nat Pagel. I would have expected Nat Pagel here. 
But I guess he's still not done fishing in uh, Pandaria. Huh. His choice is lost. This is a bit of a, you know, the Iron f Dwarven section. They've got like sections set up for all humans, dwarves, elves, night elves, gnomes, pit, the Tranai. As you can see here, we got like a. S these guys for the repairs. As you can see, we got a siege engine. We got a siege workshop set up here. Training area. And we can cross. Oh, that's going in. No! That's going into the. Ooh. So that leads to the combat area. I should not do that. So that's basically what this all means. Now, I was pretty much... Uh, and as you can see, this is the Draenei area. So that's pretty much that. Now, I'm not going back to the garrison. Because, well, as you can see, we pretty much done what we can here. This is probably... Ah, this is the mess hall. How can I help? What is it? What can I do for you? So this is where everybody is just hanging out, eating, you know that, enjoying the music. So that's basically that. So I'm going to go back to uh, Shadow Moon Valley now. Not the garrison, but to Shadow Moon itself in order to get back to business. So I'll see you guys back there and uh, enjoy. You'll see that in the next video. Bye-bye!